compounded pornographic videos in a raid of movie stores in the town. And as Ferdinand Omondi reports, there appears to be a growing appetite in the coastal town for pornography involving humans and animals. The morning raid in Mwembe Tayari targeted stores that stock movie collections. At first glance, they appear to be the usual Hollywood blockbusters, but in between the box office hits are another form of box office, pornography made in Kenya. It has been an ongoing operation targeting known porn distributors countrywide. The other day you saw ladies with dogs at Nyali, strippers at Mutwapa, and all that decency is going on within Mombasa region and the coast as well. And indeed, some of the alleged incidents have been caught on tape and are for sale in a worryingly growing industry. Aroma. This particular video stirs a woman who calls herself Shiko about to get down to business with a dreadlocked man described as a common figure in Kenyan porn. The video also has orgy scenes complete with the several actors speaking a distinct local language. <laughs> Another movie believed to have been shot at a restaurant in Mtuapa has a collection of strippers dancing to the tune of coastal songs before taking all their clothes off in erotic dancing. <laughs> the stores have also increased supply of imported porn videos involving women having sex with dogs, perhaps to feed the people's curiosity following the recent rise of news reports of bestiality cases in the country. The raid also revealed a new niche for the pirates, groundbreaking investigative stories by KTN journalists. Mohammed Ali's popular Jicho Pevu and Jaramandia Lauhalifu series are now available in a growing infringement trend of the copyright law. Kenya has been rocked this year with shocking details of pornography and indecent sexual acts ranging from the alleged porn shoot in the Lash Nyali area of Mombasa to the bestiality cases that have shaken central Kenya to the core. Ferdinand Mundi, KTN, Mombasa.